Should you bring your Filipino wife or girlfriend to the USA or your home country? In my opinion, yes. Wow. Let me tell you why. Good morning, afternoon, evening, wherever you're at. Thank you so much for stopping by. The subject today is, should you bring your Filipino wife or girlfriend to the USA? My answer is simple, it's yes. If you ask most any Filipino lady if they want to come to the USA, or most any other Western country, or any country for that matter, they'll probably say yes. The Philippines is one of the few countries where people cannot just travel to, um, you know, travel the world without a visa. Not like us, you know, our passport gets us most anywhere, right? And they can't always get a visa on their own unless it's a work visa or they already have family in the USA that can sponsor them. It kind of sucks for them, but that is just the way it is. One reason for this is many countries fear a visitor from certain countries such as the Philippines would just stay once allowed in. Kind of like the issue with our southern border. First, you need to be sure that this is a person for you, just as you would in any relationship. There are many hurdles and hoops to go through in order to bring her to the USA. And once you do, you will have certain responsibilities. And you will have to be married or get married within 90 days of arriving in the USA. I'm speaking from experience as I was married to a Filipino lady. We were together for 11 years, no regrets at all. She was and still is a great lady. I did the visa process with her and sponsored her to live in the USA. And then we brought her two children to the USA from the Philippines, from Bacolod. So I've been through the visa process for three people. Yeah, I can do the math. <laughs> and I'm doing it now with my fiance. We will get married this coming November, I had to think about it for a second there, in the Philippines and file for a spousal visa once we are man and wife. I'll talk about our decision to get married in the Philippines and, and do the spousal visa as opposed to filing a fiance visa and getting married and getting married in the USA in another video. So back to the question and my reasoning for my answer. Not all Filipino ladies will want to stay in the USA. Hell, I don't want to stay here. I'm not a lady though. Anyway, they will miss their families and friends. Most will want to work so they can send money home to their families, which is, you know, understandable. Um, people will ask you, and you may ask yourself, is she just using me to get out of the Philippines and in the USA, just wants my money, you know, that kind of stuff. Well, the first question should be, are you really in love? Do you trust each other enough? I would hope you will know the answer to these questions. Only you, only you can answer that. If you're truly in love with each other and you have spent enough time together to really know each other and she wants to come to the USA, then why not bring her? Now, a lot of people, you know, have, you know, been doing online things and like my fiance and I, April, we met over a year ago. Uh, I've been there two times this year, you know, to be with her, you know, 24 seven, but we met online. We've been every single day. We video In fact, she's probably about to call me now. Right. And we watch movies together. Uh, you know, we share that together, you know, online. We do it. It's kind of cool. Uh, we've missed one day in the last 13 and a half, almost 14 months where we haven't spent hours with videoing with each other. We've got to know each other pretty darn well and with her family, you know, and uh, yeah, great people. So we, we really got to know each other. So anyway, so your wife or girlfriend needs to experience some of the life that you have been telling her about. She will want to see for herself what the USA is all about. Trust me, it will make your relationship stronger. It will give her a better understanding of you and why you have chosen to move or retire in the Philippines. Maybe you are in the position that I'm in. I'm not sitting down in my office, but you know, 
My plan for some time has been to retire in the Philippines. My fiance is perfectly happy with living in the Philippines. After all, her friends and family are in the Philippines. She would also love to come to the USA. Our plan is to file our visa application after our wedding so she can immigrate to the USA. She will be able to live and work in the USA and together we will save more money for our home and retirement in the Philippines. Hopefully this will be for a very short period of time, one or two years at most. I'm, you know, I'm going to be 65 here in a few months and you know, heck, I deserve to retire and, you know, be able to do things on my own. I only work part time now, but whatever. Then we will just spend summers in the USA and the rest of our year in the Philippines, the best of both worlds. So yes, if the trust is there, and only you know that, you're the only ones that know the answer to that question. Bring her to the USA. Who knows, maybe you will change your mind. Maybe you'll find a whole new life, a whole new happiness in the USA once you settle down with her. I doubt that I will change my mind on where I want to spend my retirement. This is one reason I decided to create this channel, to document our journey. It'll be fun to look back on it years from now and hopefully you will follow us on our journey and you will get some valuable insight that will help you in your journey. As always, I welcome any questions you may have and any comments. I will do my best to answer any questions. And if you could be so very kind as to click the like button, which I guess is down here somewhere, and the subscribe button, it's always very much appreciated. Thank you so much for watching. God bless. Jimmy out.